It is absolutely crazy to me to see what a couple little rainstorms can do. I mean, we left for uh, Florida last Wednesday. It's almost a week ago. About a week ago, week ago. Don't do that. Everything up here was starting to dry out. It was pretty scary, really. Green grass had come and gone. The bushes started to dry out. Things weren't blossoming. We left for Florida and we got a couple rainstorms. Pretty good ones while we were gone, is what they said. And then we got one last night. And it is like night and day difference. I hiked up this hill last Monday and nothing was blooming. And now you can see it. It is like an overgrown forest. The road's green again. It's crazy. Look at the wildflowers are out. Full bloom. H2O, man. This world wouldn't exist without it. You know what's crazy? I was talking to Danny about this yesterday. Maybe we're wrong. I don't know. It seems to make sense to me, but... We're talking, we're like, the water is always here. We never lose the water. Like, it's always somewhere, right? Like, people are like, oh, we're in a drought year. It's not like the water is just gone, hasn't left the universe. It's somewhere. It's either in snowpack, it's in the reservoirs, the lakes, the oceans, the water table underneath the ground, or it's in the clouds. Is that right? I mean, just a big cycle. Water is just a big cycle. Anyway. <laughs> I'm no scientist by any means, but it was kind of interesting to think about that. Danny brought that up, and I'm like, yeah, you're right, because it really, when it evaporates, it forms clouds. Am I correct? And that's really the only way the water leaves the earth. I guess people consume it, and we pee it out, and that water goes through a filtration system that eventually is filtered back into water. It's the way a septic system works anyways. You scientists at home, let me know if that's a correct theory. The water is always in some state, either in the air or on the ground or under the ground. But look at this trail. It is so overgrown now. What a beautiful day. Look at that thing. Caw, caw. I want him to come land on my arm. Caw, caw. Oh, gave him the wrong signal. That must have meant go away. Come on, time to go home. Caw, 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 caw. Such a stubborn falcon. Wow. So last night was a good test. Like I was telling you guys yesterday, the wind blows up here all the time. See the grill? It came from over there, blew right over here. But look at the table and chairs never moved. And the umbrella didn't go spearing through a window. Well, I think we good. We good? Yeah, we's good. We's good, huh? This character, he found him some lunch. <laughs> he found you some lunch, huh? Look it. He loves it. How is it? You good? <laughs> Get away from you, mud ball. He's been eating dirt for like five minutes. He has not. Yes, he has. And you haven't done anything not. about it. <laughs> that dirt's so good. Look. I want some more. I want some more. Where's that more dirt? <laughs> Brayla was just like that. She would eat dirt and rocks all the time. What's your name? Corbin, you watch the Hushin videos? And Casey. And Casey here. Go tell these guys to subscribe to Hushin. Say, and Casey Levere. Guys, we need like 19,000 to hit 100,000. Well, it's good meeting you, Corbin. High five. A little fun fact. Should I tell him or not? Sure. His mom, who used to be my girlfriend, was in fourth grade, and she was in sixth grade. Is that good? <laughs> guys, we are cooking outside tonight. And it looks amazing. Just doing some, uh, Kaylee wanted turkey burgers. We're doing some venison burgers. But these venison burgers are a little bit different. They're amazing. That's what's different. They are filled with bacon and ham and peppers. And if you guys want to know the whole recipe, here's the link to go watch the new Hushin video I put up yesterday. Me and Eric did these a couple weeks ago when we were turkey hunting. He showed me the recipe. And they, honestly best hamburger cheeseburger you will ever eat and you can you don't have to use venison or elk or antelope you can use beef turkey whatever you want go watch the video they are bomb dubbomb.com may i say i may say casey levere does the l-o-g vlog